Laura came to court that morning with the support of her doctor, who said her confinement had been self-inflicted for years. She said Clayton had forbidden her to tell her story, but today, after 25 years, she told. I was trying to buy candles for the storm, but the general store was closed. Everybody had gone home to lash the windows and cellars. Then I saw Violet walking across the town square. She was upset. She was angry and crying, and there was blood on her face and on her little white sweater. I ran to her to see if she was all right, but before I could say much, she started screaming at me about Abigail. She said Abigail was mean and crazy and that she'd hit her. I tried to calm her, calm her down, but she said she was going to go tell her mama. Violet was glad that Abigail had hit her because now everybody would know that Abigail was crazy and they would lock her away forever. I pleaded with her, but she ran away. I ran after her and I, I grabbed her. I was trying to talk to her. She was in a rage and she tore herself from my hands. She fell away from me and she fell through the old planks that covered the well. I reached out for her. But I only caught a little gold locket that was around her neck. It broke the chain snapped. The bottom was gone. She's gone. Do you expect the court to believe that Violet's death was an accident? And that Bart Ader had a heart attack. Mr. Waters, I object. Counsel is trying to take a woman who's been institutionalized for 20 years and get her to take the responsibility for all of them. And Lita, did you kill Lita, Ada, too? Mr. Waters, you will have a chance to cross-examine the witness. Laura, did you kill Lita, Ada? No. What was the corruption of Ivan Isaac's courtroom, Cleo? And just where is this line of questioning leading? I want to prove to the court that Abigail Fuller was innocent of the history that this town has branded her with for the past 25 years, Your Honor. And now I would like to show the court why she didn't kill me to aim. Are you all right? I don't understand. What for? Your Honor, I would like to call Abigail Fuller to the stand. But Mr. Waters hasn't had a chance to cross-examine this witness. He may not have to, Your Honor, if you let me bring her on the stand. I don't want to cross-examine her. I want her testimony stricken from the record and declared non compass matters. I know who killed Lita Ader, Your Honor. You do? Objection. Please, Your Honor. I won't be wasting the court's time. Let me put Abigail Fuller on the stand. Overruled. The counselor called you with. The defense calls Abigail Fuller. Uh, Miss Fuller, you may.